Hey guys, Ogre Barbarian here, and I didn't record sound as I was recording the Chemo Versus, so we're going to try to record over the recording and kind of talk our way through it this time, hopefully. <laughs> oh, Alright, so this time we're going in with Chemo. we got three level ones. We're going to try the last two nodes of the Quiet City Challenge. And as you can see, we got the level one characters. We got Hawkman, Talia, and Captain Boomerang. Decided not to take Aqualad so that I wouldn't be tempted to uh, use the damage immunity. Decided to only use basic attacks with the level one characters. Luckily, two of them get wiped out there pretty quick with that AoE. And Camo slowly does his thing with his uh, men's so captain boomerang i do have it like gear two just because i wanted to test him out a little bit he looked like a lot of fun and i wasn't really sure on some of his wording for his uh second skill so i upgraded him a little bit just to see what it was all about but we're concerned with camo right now and his ability to beat these minions down and he, he does a pretty good job obviously as we can see So, gotta love that counterattack. Yeah, I really wish I had paid attention to the sound setting before I had started this. Uh, there was supposed to be game sound along with my voiceover as usual for this, and now I'm very disappointed that it didn't happen. But, you know, it happens. So... Here we're just building up our men's stack as usual. And we're using Fallout to slow everybody down so that we can get the bleeds out there. And then here we pick up a huge stack of speed down thanks to Captain Boomerang. And it's thanks to Kemo's counterattack, the bleeds, the disease, and everything else that is going on here, that allowed me to kind of pick up this win. So, you know, that counterattack, if you didn't take it, as your first upgrade, you need to take it real soon. It's really good. So. And here we got Captain Boomerang talking to Heatwave, who's also talking to Mirror Master and Captain Cold. I like that they put all four of the rogues in there and Flash in there. That was really neat. I love these storylines. They're a lot of fun, usually. So. But this time we have less time to build up the men's. So we really need Camo to start countering attack. And luckily one AoE took out the, uh, the little tag-along guys that we have. So that way the enemies are hitting me so I can counterattack, get more men's. More men's equals more overheal. The more overheal we have going into the final wave, the better. Because it's only two waves long in this time. So. And these guys do hit kind of hard. So, I mean... We do have to be careful for that, especially since Captain Boomerang does do a, uh, a lot of speed downs, which is another reason to put the speed downs on everybody, just to kind of even it out a little bit, or they would have been doing a lot more damage. So, and again, we're going to see that these, you know, retaliation attacks are what's really important here for Camo. So, this is how we win, is these counterattacks. And the, you know, bleed from the disease. So, here we go. Pop, pop, and pop. And there it is. That was the entire challenge. But it just goes to show you that, you know, don't underestimate the power of that counterattack. So. But, hopefully the audio works on this version. As you can see, I kind of didn't remember to do it. I'm very disappointed in myself, 